Magandang buhay po at welcome po muli dito sa aking channel. Ngayon naman po ang aking pong ituturo ay how to differentiate between polynomial equation and not polynomial equation. So magpipresent po ako ng different examples ng polynomial equation at different examples ng not polynomial equation. Okay, so unahin po natin ang mga equation that is not polynomial. Ito po yung condition. A polynomial must not have the following. Letter A, negative exponent. So kapag ang ating pong equation, kagaya po nito, ay mayroon pong negative exponent, hindi po siya polynomial. Ano po? So mayroon siyang negative 2 exponent. So dapat, ang exponent niya ay positive integers. Okay? So, letter B, condition. Variable in the denominator. So, dapat wala pong variable in the denominator. So, kagaya po ng equation na ito, 3 over x plus 7x is equal to 0. So, meron po tayong denominator dito na variable x. Meaning to say, hindi po siya polynomial. Okay? So, letter C, fractional exponent. Ano po ba yung fractional exponent? Ito po yung exponent na fraction. Kagaya po nito, x raised to 1 half minus 6x plus 1 is equal to 0. So, mayroon po tayong yan, exponent na 1 half. So, meaning to say, hindi po yan polynomial. At letter D, variable exponent. So, ano po yung variable exponent? Dapat wala po. Ito po x raised to m minus 2x is equal to 0. So, mayroon po tayong exponent na variable. So, mean to say, hindi po yan polynomial. Next condition, radicand variable. So, kapag may variable po tayo sa ating radicand, i mean to say, hindi po siya polynomial. Kagaya po nito, x squared plus square root of x minus 5 is equal to 0. So, meron po tayong radikan. Yan po, x. So, hindi po iyan polynomial. So, dapat, ang radikan lang po dyan ay numbers. Okay, so bago po ako mag-present ng examples ng polynomial, click lamang po ang like. And kung bago ka po sa aking channel, click po ang subscribe at notification bell upang ma-update ka sa iba pang video tutorial na aking i-upload sa mga susunod. At shoutout nga pala kay Nana Matsumoto. At sa mga gusto pong magpa-shoutout, comment lang po sa comment box. Okay, so ito naman po yung mga example of polynomial equation. Okay, the first one is x minus 5 is equal to 0. So what kind of equation is this? So ang highest exponent po natin dyan ay 1. So ang tawag po dito ay linear equation. Another one x squared plus x minus 5 is equal to 0. Ang highest exponent po dyan ay 2. So, mean to say, that is quadratic equation. And, third one, x cubed plus 2x squared is equal to 0. Ang highest exponent po dyan ay 3. So, that is cubic equation. Another one, x raised to the fourth power plus x squared minus 8 is equal to 0. Ang highest exponent po natin dyan ay 4. Mean to say, wala na pong exact na term para identify ito. Kundi ang term po dyan ay polynomial equation. And so, x raised to 30 minus 1 is equal to 0. Ang highest exponent po dyan ay 30. So, wala pong exact na term para banggitin yan. Yan pa rin po ay tinatawag na polynomial equation. But, nabanggit lang po natin yung linear equation, quadratic equation, cubic. Yan po ay kapag mas mababa sa 4 yung kanyang highest exponent or degree. Pero lahat po yan, ang tawag po dyan ay polynomial equation. Okay, so let's have this activity. Tell whether the given is polynomial equation or not. Number 1, x raised to the negative 3 plus 5 is equal to 0. Is it polynomial equation or not? If you notice here, ang ating pong exponent ay negative Mean to say, this is not polynomial equation. So, dapat ang exponent po ay positive. Number 2. 5 raised to the x power minus x plus 1 is equal to 0. 
So again, mayroon po tayong exponent dito na variable. Ito po x, meaning to say, this is not polynomial equation. Okay? So dapat, ang ating pong exponent ay positive numbers or positive integers. Number 3, negative x squared plus 7x is equal to 0. So here, yung ating pong exponent ay 2. Wala po tayong denominator na variable. So mean to say, kapag ganito po yung given, ito po ay polynomial equation. Okay? Okay, so how about this number 4 equation? Is it polynomial or not? So tignan po natin. 2x cubed plus square root of x is equal to 0. So yung first term po natin, ang exponent po ng x ay 3. So positive. So pwede po yan. So yung second term po natin, square root of x. So meron po tayong square root at ang kanyang radicand ay variable. So again, kapag ang radicand ay variable, so not polynomial equation. Okay, so number 5. x cubed plus square root of 3 is equal to 0. Okay, eto meron ding square root. So tingnan natin. Yung first term po natin, x cubed, ang exponent po ay 3. And then yung second term natin, square root of 3. So, ang radicand po natin dito ay number. So, kapag number po ang radicand, pwede pong polynomial yan. So, this is polynomial equation. Okay? So, for number 6, x over or 3 over x plus 3x is equal to 0. So, meron po tayong fraction yung first term. And, yung kanyang denominator po ay variable. So, again, kapag ang denominator po ay variable, this is not polynomial equation. Okay? Number 3. x raised to 1 half over 9 plus 5 is equal to 0. So, again, meron po tayong fraction pero ang denominator po ay number. So, okay lang yan. Pero, meron po tayong exponent na fraction. So, mean to say, this is not polynomial equation. Okay, so how about this number 8 example? 3 over x raised to negative 2 plus 3x is equal to 0. So if you notice here, meron po tayong fraction yung first term. At ang denominator po niya ay variable. Pero ang kanyang exponent ay negative. Okay, ano po kaya ito? Polynomial equation or not? Okay, tignan po natin. Pwede po kasing isimplify yan. So pag isimplify po yan, Applying the law of exponent, yan po ay magiging 3. Kapag po kasi negative yung kanyang exponent at gagawin natin positive, ay iakyat po natin sa denominator. So this will become x raised, x raised to negative 2. Pag dinala po sa numerator ay magiging x raised to positive 2. Then, plus 3x is equal to 0. So ano po yung naging result? Is it polynomial equation or not? So, wala na pong negative exponent. Wala na pong uh, variable na nasa denominator. So, mean to say, this is polynomial equation. Okay, how about number 9? x raised to the 20 power is equal to 1. What is this? Polynomial equation or not? So, still, wala pong negative exponent. Wala pong fraction exponent. Wala pong... Variable na nasa denominator. So, mean to say, this is polynomial equation. Okay, so salamat po sa inyong panood. Kung meron po kayong katanungan tungkol sa lesson na ito, ay comment lang po sa comment box at hintayin po ninyo yung aking reply. Be sure lang po na kayo po ay mag-like at mag-subscribe upang sa gawin, pag ako po ay nag-reply, ay manotify po kayo sa aking reply.